The FBI recently blamed North Korea for last month's cyber attack on Sony Pictures, but experts remain highly skeptical of the U.S. agency's claims. Yeah, that's right. New information has come to light that seems to suggest a disgruntled former employee of Sony was behind the attack, not Pyongyang's elite band of cyber hackers. Kim Hyun Bin reports. U.S. cyber experts say they have concrete evidence that a former employee of Sony Pictures was behind the recent hacking attack on the company, not North Korea. Cyber intelligence firm North Corporation said Monday that it had narrowed its search to six suspects, one of whom is a former Sony employee who had the technical capabilities to carry out such an attack. North says it had data on the malware used in the attack, and that it pointed to information that only Sony Insider would have. The firm's findings run counter to what the FBI has said about the case. They have pinned the attack on Pyongyang and are sticking to their guns. The FBI, in a statement on Tuesday, said there was no credible information to suggest anyone other than North Korea was involved. From the outset, suspicion in the attack was directed at the North. The virus used for the attack was coded in a Korean language environment similar to the ones that struck South Korean banks in 2013. But experts say that is not enough to link the attack on Sony to North Korea as the malware is available on the black market. Cybersecurity experts say there's a slight chance the FBI's conclusion might be correct, since they may have access to intelligence that points directly to North Korea, intelligence the FBI has chosen not to disclose. Kim Hyun-bin, Arirang News.